Hey guys, Tiffany Bethia here, founder of the Kingdom Boss brand, where we give Christian entrepreneurs the tools to manifest and maintain massive success and significance in their life and business. And today, guys, I want to talk to you about how prayer might be hurting your vision. Now, some of you are thinking, Tiffany, how how is that possible? How might prayer be hurting my vision? But come on close. Let's talk about it. <laughs> You know, in my years of not only being an entrepreneur, but also working with entrepreneurs in various aspects of their business, obviously primarily marketing and branding, I've observed that for Christian entrepreneurs, it is very easy for us to believe God, to trust God, and to even, you know, find that scripture that we're standing on, to call that prayer partner and that accountability partner, and really begin doing the work on the spiritual aspect However, sometimes we forget that it's important to put faith with those works. And so we know it, guys, that faith without works is dead. But if we can be honest, sometimes the faith, is, as difficult as it can be, is the easier part. It's the works and the actual implementation or execution where we get stuck. We'll pray about it. We'll praise about it. We'll worship. We'll speak it into existence. We'll tell our girlfriends and our accountability partners that this thing is coming to pass. However, when it comes down to really rolling up our sleeves and putting in the work that's going to really bring that thing to life, that's where we often get stuck. I believe that, you know, speaking it and, and praying over it is wonderful, but we've got to begin to execute after that. I always joke and say I'm going to write a book about what to do when we get up from the altar <laughs> because so many of us know that that safe place is in God, that we can come to Christ about anything, including our businesses, that book, that speaking ministry, and whatever it is that God has you building, we know that we can trust him with it, we can pray to him, and we can have faith in him. But the real test of whether or not we believe it and that we're going to see the answer to those prayers is what? You got it. It is action, execution, and putting steps into connecting that faith. And so I really want to encourage you guys today not to get stuck at the prayer phase, not to get stuck at faith, even though it is step number one. And we know that, that the first thing we've got to do is bathe all of our efforts in prayer and know that we're really just stewards over the businesses and the brands and the ministry that God has placed inside of us, that it's really his, that he's allowing us to to manifest in the earth. And so, yes, we must pray to him first. And we absolutely must say, Father, what is your desire for this business? What is your desire for this brand? How do you want me to carry this out in the earth? However, after that, we've got to get up and we've got to get in action. We've got to get in motion if we really want to see the answer and the manifestation that God desires for us to see as well. So, faith without what? works is dead you got it so i'm encouraging you don't get stuck at the faith stage get to the works so that you can also get to the manifestation i'm believing god with you and for you that everything that he says is yours absolutely is yours and of course guys you know you can find me at the intersection of faith and business. If you want to know more about the Kingdom Boss brand, I encourage you to come on over to www.kingdomboss.com and join my spirit-led entrepreneurs community where we have a whole community, a thriving, growing community of Christian entrepreneurs who encourage one another, speak life over one another, share resources and information that's helping all of us to grow more personally and professionally. And until next time, I'll see you guys later.